Well, it's an absolutely lovely uh, Saturday here. Uh, Saturday afternoon now, just out uh, getting a few bits and pieces uh, down here at the shops. Uh, and I thought I'd shoot a bit of a video. Um, first of all, to say thank you for all of you that have uh, done comments, uh, made comments on my videos uh, with uh, pointers and thank yous. That's greatly appreciated. Um, I love all the feedback and all the thanks. So um, I can't name you all, but uh, you know who you are and thanks very much. Um, I also wanted to do something um, about, and I was meaning to do it over the last couple of days, uh, but to do it about complaints uh, because uh, the bigger you get, uh, as I always say, the more complaints you have, but also the uh, the amount of praise you get. Um, and we get uh, loads of complaints uh, because we do loads of work. Uh, now we try to mitigate against any complaints, but we do get some. And uh, I'll put a picture uh, up next of one of the complaints. And the complaint was, was that... Um, that came through the person lives about 15 minutes out of town so they live a, a good age away and she complained that one of the lads had left drops of water and had made a couple of splashes in the bathroom when cleaning the window in there so I'll put the the picture up at the end of this video but you'll see that it's so so small it's uh, it's really uh, ridiculous to get somebody to do 15 minutes out there and 15 minutes back uh, over something that you could do yourself quicker than uh, picking up the phone to complain uh, but the customer is always right and especially in these days of social media where it's so easy for people to complain um, but again that's something as a boss you have to be able to just suck it up um, you have to expect complaints and not take it personally like um, and, and what do you do you, you sort it out for the customer one of the lads goes home close enough to the customer's house or could go home that way so he went and had it dealt with in five seconds um, again you don't get shirky with the customer you don't start giving out you don't start complaining you just sort the problem out for them then and there to leave them happy um, because there's some amount of complainers and whingers out there uh, don't get me wrong 99% of people are lovely but there are those couple of people that you just have to deal with but your reputation is king so being nice with them going and sorting out their problem uh, leaving them happy is the best thing to get promptly onto it as well and not to leave it too long um, and that's kind of how we deal with complaints and again sometimes when you, your work gets criticised and that uh, it's not easy to, to uh, take it as uh, constructive criticism or not to think oh I'm not getting paid to do this kind of a job and that kind of a job all of that can go back to your price instruction maybe you didn't price the job uh, good enough or um, or maybe that criticism is fair uh, or if the criticism isn't fair uh, the customer is always right try not to take it uh, personal um, and just try and develop the skills of just letting it roll off your back it really doesn't matter at the end of the day um, I've just gone to visit uh, a friend of mine who is dying of cancer and uh, and probably won't last too long. Like all those silly little complaints really don't matter in the grand scheme of things. Um, living every day like it's your last, uh, really not allowing stuff like that to get to you. So just a little weekend shot. I hope you guys are having a great weekend. Probably time to head home. <laughs>